Today's menu is sauerkraut and Polish sausage. Well, you know, while you're cooking sauerkraut, which takes a while, it's a smelly thing. So I intend to I lit up a candle, as you can tell right here, to absorb the smell. And now I'll tell you how long it all takes. It takes about two hours for the sauerkraut, an hour, hour and a half for the Polish sausage. So let's go see what's going on now. Well, we're going to see how this is progressing. Oh, I have to mix this all up. In here is sauerkraut, onion, garlic, and some uh, bacon strips. Now, like I say, this is going to be a while for cooking. You'll know when it's done is when the onions combine with the sauerkraut. As for the Polish sausage, it's already cooking. And in there, I've got onion, and I've got a little bit of garlic and water. And that's what that also has to cook. The sauerkraut is finished, ready to be strained, and so is the Polish sausage. So we'll shut it all off. First I'll drain this Polish sausage. Here, go drain the Polish sausage. And put it in this dish. Rinse this out because you're going to use it for the sauerkraut. Now we're going to drain the sauerkraut. Alright? We're going to put this, sour, this here in this bowl. Here, here is the finished product. Set it up the way you would set it up for people. It's for other. Uh, Boom, mix it up, and the Polish sausage. Take a couple of pieces of Polish sausage, and the sauerkraut, which is, you can have it with rye bread, or you can eat it like this, or even potatoes, whatever you want. There it is. It looks good. And I hope you like it.